Welcome to another edition of Desarian Plays, The Secret World. I'm uh, back at Norma Ray, Norma, <laughs> Norma Ray, not Norma Ray, Norma Creed. Uh, and as I mentioned in the last episode, she's got a quest here that uh, is an investigation mission called Something Wicked. And uh, we're going to take a look at that and go through it. It's a it's an investigation mission, so it's a little longer and more involved. Uh, and I'm probably going to have to look at spoilers to figure it out because I don't feel like really investigating it that much. So let's see what she has to say. It's a pressure building. The kind that comes before a storm when it builds and builds but just won't break. Yeah, the ravens, they feel it too. Last time I saw them like this, when the trees were more birds than branches, there were murders. Yeah, mm. that was back in 2002 tail end of a long and wicked hot summer. Wicked hot. In August, the whole town smelled rotten, and we hadn't seen a drop of rain since June. So this town has had when problems even before all of this broke out. The killing stopped. Never believed what the paper wrote about that vagrant, neither did Helen, despite those boys in city council leaning on her. Well, she took a beating. Could have hurt her career, but she was right. It wasn't human hands cut those girls open. An unkind of the ravens, isn't that what they call it? My idea of reading is the TV guide, not anything that could charitably be called literature. <laughs> but even I know signs importance when I see them. Signs importance. Okay, so we're going to have to find out about information about the murders. Uh, a case of multiple murders in a small town like Kingsmith must have been widely discussed in the newspapers. Find more about the case. Really? Like, that's very vague. Uh, what did she talk about in the... Hmm. So where are we going to find stuff about the paper? See? Uh, like, that's just so vague. Like, I know the papers, but, uh, I don't know. Maybe we'll go up uh, to the sheriff's office and see if we can find anything. Hmm. So, uh nothing up there I, I, I've got a little spoiler going on here and it says where would you find decade old records and uh, you know I don't know in this little town uh, but apparently up in the town hall they've got some information so we have to find town hall I think this is it right here in the middle yeah probably so right on main street uh, so let's find the town hall Ah, yes, see, right here, it's Kingsmith Town Hall. It looks pretty ominous with the zombies out in front and stuff. So let's go inside and uh, look around. Uh, if we didn't get zombies, we did get zombies. <laughs> okay, see, nothing here, a bunch of paintings. And not been up here. Ah, uh, look, that's all. Oh, there's all sorts of file cabinets and stuff. Hopefully we don't have to... Oh, 98, 91. What year did she say? I thought she said 2002. Hmm, let's look at 98. 99, I guess. Empty. Oh. They're all different. Okay. She said... See, I thought she said... Uh, she did, 2002. Aha! So, I'm going to take a picture of this. Uh, that way I have it. Uh, so it's Solomon Chronicle, killer charged, transient farmland, Larry Chicken has been formally charged with the murders of King Miss Girl, so-and-so, and so-and-so, and so-and-so. -and -so -and -so. Townies, who had been holding an all-night vigil on Elm, gave an emotional response to the announcement this morning. It marks the ends of the summer of horror that gripped our little town for three months, and a state of police manhunt making mainland news. Sheriff Bannerman 
would not make further comments on the case ahead of the state press briefing. She has, however, asked the townies remain calm while justice works its course. We at the Chronicle know many of our readers have questions of the efficiency of Sunderland County Sheriff Office, but their Sheriff's Office, but there will be time for those questions in the months to follow the trial. Okay, so I think uh, we need to find information about the murder case. So it sounds like the sheriff knows what's going on. Uh, so um, I'm going to head to the sheriff's office and see what she has to say. All right. I Let's see if... Whatever the good old boys didn't whitewash should still be on file. If she has anything to say. Hmm. Find information. Hmm, 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 hmm. Maybe there's some other information around. Oh, you know what? I can use the computer. Hmm, let me let me see. Yeah, let's do use the computer. All right. So uh, we're trying to find information about the murder case. Uh, it's not going to involve the security system. So let's do the suspect database. And, oh, uh, who was, what was the name? Let me look at my screenshot. All right, so looking at my sheet, uh, or my screenshot that I took, it's Larry Checkin that uh, actually was the guy that was charged. Yeah, he was formally charged, so. Oops, let's uh, hit Larry Checkin and see what it says. Ah, good. Solon County Police, number whatever. Subject, death of suspect Larry in custody. Alone with the suspect at 1 a.m. went over his full written confession for, whatever, multiple inconsistencies with his stories and events, including redacted. You also, you asked my ghost for the truth, Sheriff. Checkin took his own life in his cell between the hours of 4 and 5 a.m. Discovered at 7 a.m. Seen already redacted. All outstanding work on the investigation to be closed. So I'm going to take a screenshot of that. And, uh, okay. So they want me to examine the cell for more clues? Like, his, his cell? That doesn't make sense. Okay, so it, it, the the clue says to examine the cell for more clues. The uh, the help guide I'm looking at, it says, you know, that he said on the computer, talk to my ghost for the truth. You must find a way to talk to his ghost. So uh, the spoiler is to say, just go die. You slash reset, return to the cell and find the ghost inside. He is star staring at the wall. Inspect where he is looking for the update. Okay. So we're going to try this. Let's do slash reset. Oh my. I did not know that was even an option. Okay. So we're going to release now. Oh, and we're in ghost form. No. Oh, we're in ghost form. So let's... uh. Yeah, back up where the body is. And now we're near the body, but you can see now that the Del's jail cell is open and he's staring at the wall. See, there's Larry. And what does that say? Bannerman. Bannerman is hot? Okay, I don't know what that means. Yes, let's resurrect. There's something in there. What the heck? All right, we're going to try this again. Let's reset. Okay. So now this time I'm inside the cell, which I might have screwed myself by doing this. But let's see. It says, the white raven whispers golden girl's sorrowful secret are never told. Take a picture of that. Okay. The white raven's whisper golden girl's sorrowful secrets are never told. 
Okay. But. Uh, oh, come on. I'm examining the cell. Uh, I don't know how this updates. Let me reset again. Reset. Oh, I see. I actually had to click on the wall while I was dead to get this image to pop up, which is the same one I took a picture of. Okay, find out what the cryptic message means. Okay. Alright, so we're back to corporeal form. And uh, so now we got to figure out what what's up with the white ravens. Uh, this one I have no idea. Uh, maybe. Well, I don't know about any white ravens. Do you? There's a black raven, but that's not a white raven. Uh, let me look this up. Okay, according to this hint, we need to stay dead. Good grief. So we're going to stay dead. <laughs> All right. And here on top of the police car, now there's a white raven. So we're going to follow this guy. Wait, did he just disappear and didn't come? It's like I didn't do it right. Well, he's not there. Ah, oh, it's getting aggravating. Come on. He disappeared, like right here. Are there any other white ravens around? Let me look. Okay, I see. I chased too quickly behind him. You can see, if you kind of let him fly and then disappear, uh, and then you, you just go in that direction, then there'll be another one. Uh, so, let's see. Let this guy fly. Disappear. So, we're going to go up here. And there's another one. Fly and disappear. Kind of eerie, isn't it? Ah, there's another one. Six for gold. What? Uh, and the sound is kind of freaky as. Holy crap! This is spooky. That is awesome. <laughs> okay. Oh wait, they're telling us. They're telling something. Six for. Two for joy. One for sorrow. I wonder if that's like a phone number. Hmm. Okay, this one I had to look up uh, again. Uh, apparently, you talk to them in the order that you're supposed to talk to them. Uh, the 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 riddle was the white ravens whisper golden girl sorrowful secrets are never told. Uh, so this one's gold. Joy, which isn't never used. One for sorrow. sorrow is used. That's the last, or one of the last. Five for silver. Silver is not used. Three for a girl. 
girl is used. Seven for a secret, never to be told. And that's the last line. Four for a boy. Okay. So I think Seven we talk to the first one. Six for gold. Golden girls. It runs away. So now I need girls. Girl. It's sorrow. Seven for a secret. Never to be told. That's the last one. I need sorrow. Five for silver. One for sorrow. There we go, sorrow. And then Five the last silver. one. Ha <laughs> I guess so. And we're still in ghost form. Ooh, what the heck? <gasps> Look at that! That is awesome. How cool is that? Okay, I found Jack. Okay, that was the end of it, just to find Jack. <laughs> As you can hear, I was taking pictures because uh, it's going to be the, the photo cover for this because that was really cool. I like that. All right, you really had Zern worried there. I reminded him that you're expendable, but I admit I was very glad to have you back. Redeploying someone at that stage would be such a bitch. There's a number of murders in Kingsmith that point to Jack's unique physiognomy. Physiognomy. I don't know how to say that word. I won't bore you with the tragic details. Boy flees famine and boy works on Magnus' farm. Magnus' daughters die. Magus tears into boy... Magus tears into boy in pumpkin patch. The moral of the story, Kingsmith is not a good place to die, so try not to. <laughs> yeah, I'd have to agree with that. <laughs> oh, wow. All right, well, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Uh, that's all we're going to do for that one, and uh, we'll find some more main missions after this. So uh, please give me a like and leave any comments that you might have. And as always, please subscribe. Your subscriptions really do mean a lot to me, and I check out your channels and everything else. So... Till next time, bye.